in those rocks. You see? Inside. In the mouth of frozen rocks. A creature lives there. A real creature, Big Glomar. Glomar the greatest. Shut up, Freddy. With an alien being. A barium. That's his bones. His veins. It's blood. And your brain is addled again, eh? Glomar, they say? Ah, oh, that's something I'd like to see. You've no right to rip the meat off the body. You've no right to take away. Become a prospector. The future belongs to Habardium. Habardium, the raw material for manufacturing positron brains, the gateway to progress. Our mining company offers employee perks, regular pay, interesting work in space. Glomar lives. Glomar lives. Relax, Fred. You're hitting the sauce too much. Habardium is an element, a mineral. Don't you get it? It's not. It doesn't live, Freddy. It's not living. Try once again to believe in chemistry for a minute. And don't puke on my boots. I'm not drunk. Just stupid swine. They don't give a shit where they get Habardium from. It's just a way of making money to you. Oh, you are stupid swines! All of you! Hey, hey, what about you, buddy? You believe in Glomar? Yeah. You believe in Glomar's heart? I got bad news for you, Freddy. If Glomar exists, he doesn't give a shit about us. I held Hubardium in my hands. Hubardium, the most valuable and treacherous thing in the universe. Regardless of whether it's Glomar's bones or just rocks. I've seen guys go nuts over it. Craziness passed me by. Didn't affect me. The only thing I've been unlucky with is women. Well, well, well. What a waste of alcohol. How much more do you have to drink, Arnie, before you realize that you still won't get drunk? Your brain is resistant to Hobardium. There's no point in trying to get boozed up. Lydia, you're here. Yeah. I was just wondering what you were doing these days. And I wanted to see you once more. Sure. Just remember the old days, right? To cry on my shoulder? That's what always turned me on about you the most, babe. Your endless cheek. Arnie, I'm sorry about the way it ended between us. Really, I am. I know that I hurt you. That I said all sorts of terrible things to you, but... What awful things? That I was selfish and had no heart? It helps not to have a heart. At least nobody will ever break it. Glomar might be jealous of me. Glomar? Oh, there's that stupid prospector's talk again. But you know, if you by some chance had a heart, you think I could be the one to break it? What the hell are you playing at? Let me guess. Warren disappointed you. And you gave him the boot because you love me and me alone. Yeah. Ah, cut the crap, Livia. A man won't let himself be fooled twice. But I didn't break up with Warren. Then what? He got rid of you? Not at all. We're always together. I even told him that we should get married and... Way to go. Maybe I should be your bridesmaid. You know I wouldn't take the risk if I was in your place, Livia. What if I was to break his face by mistake? Oh, don't be horrible, Arnie. After all, you guys were friends, you know, buddies. The two best prospectors the company ever had. I've always been sorry that I, unfortunately, came between you two. Spare me, Livia. If you want to go stir someone's heart, go and give poetry readings at an old folks' home. I've already stirred yours. It still eats you up, Arnie. Admit it. You still care about me. Because if it was all the same to you, you wouldn't be sitting here. You wouldn't be trying to get drunk, even though you are hopeless at it. Don't flatter yourself, honey. You're not just here for the sake of it. You've never done anything without a reason. I gather it's probably not a wedding invitation, but I know you want something from me. <laughs> That's what I thought. You're so damn clever, Arnie. You always catch me out when I try it on with sentiment. But now I'm so desperate that I'll do anything. 
Okay, yes, you're right. I want something from you. You're my last hope. Arnold, Warren is in a terrible jam. It may cost him his life. And you're the only person in the world who can get him out of it. Warren stayed on Alpha Prime. The company opened a new Habardium mine there. It seemed there was a huge deposit. The radiation was very strong. Maybe... Maybe too strong. Something happened there. God damn it, what sort of bullshit is this? We all know that the company doesn't give a damn about prospectors. I didn't count on them helping Warren. If someone here obviously laid mines. They tried to cut Alpha off to get rid of witnesses. Maybe they'll destroy it completely. It's great that we've got tickets for seats in the front row. Arnie, come for me. I'm on the bridge. We must get down there. We have to. Before.
the oxygen dispensers located on the walls. This is what Herbardium does to a person. Or should I say, former person.
evading the lift. Arnie, I've located you. I'm about to do it, honey. The only thing is I didn't bring enough straitjackets for all those Hobardium nutters. Porca puttana, it's goddamn work. Bellini, I'm such a scumbag. Why didn't I learn this in school, cazzo? What about a consultation, maestro? I might like to try it. Well, another nutcase? Mutant, questo un po' toccato. Bardium, help! Da, vai via, va! So far I still haven't fired. Um, you are an 
normale Vardium, no Train up the spout, no Yeah, intelligente <laughs> Hey, ascolta Mutants, chicken, very, very cowardly If someone screams at them properly Ah, they sometimes get frightened and run Capish? Yeah, sure, I saw it What you got here? Reckon, nice thing, perfetto No hacker will turn his nose up at it A reckon like this, it opens all doors Cameras, it messes up Machines, it botches And therefore, almost everything You want to try it? Doors, there, come on. And what's behind those doors? An arsenal, machine guns, cannons, lots and lots. Boom, 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 boom. Thank you, fine thing. That'll come in handy. I must go down there, you see, underground. I'm looking for a guy, a certain Warren Reynolds. Ah, Warren, si si, lucky guy. A fortunato quello. This figone, always with him. An amazing lady, this Livia. Bella donna, very beautiful. What happened to her? Livia's in orbit. She's waiting until I find Warren and another spaceship. Harford, you a ship? Here? Not at all, no ship. Not on Alpha. Otherwise, Paolo will be long gone. Vroom, 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 get a move on. Go away from here. Livia said... Nonsense. No ship anywhere. Perhaps Warren secretly hide Flotilia in his shoe. It's the only way. He has spaceship in his pocket. I'll have to start by finding Warren. I can't wait to hear the nice things he has to tell me. No, no, not that way. It's conjuro. Many, many mutants. Better to take lift than down. Nice and comfortable. Down down floor and empty passageway. You know a lot, eh? He'll certainly find the safest route for me. You know, Paolo no like shooting. Morbido. Uno body, due bodies, lots of bodies. Boom, bang, everywhere. Very nasty. Prefer Bellini to Tortellini. <laughs> What's this now? Parco, zio, we are not moving. <laughs> Never mind. I am a guide. Nobody nowhere. Let's go proudly on.
are shooting once more, and at me again. Ouch! Ah, they've killed me. I am it. My poor leg completely dead. They've killed me. I've been shot by them. I will get blood poisoning. Perhaps it won't be so bad, Paolo. Pour some rum on it and carry on. No, Paolo go nowhere. Paolo is a cripple. Disability pension. Not well. Ruined. Sick. Io me ne frego. You can go alone, Arnold. How about you at least give me a map, Paolo the cripple? Map is just here. Ascolta. Important place is control room. Terminals, computers. You can push an arrow. Another lift. Perfetto, like this. Piece of cake, no worries. Are you trying to say that there's another lift here that could be unlocked from the control room? Yes, precisely that. Arnold is seriously a very clever man. <laughs>